Man, those lights go hard. A lot has happened since I was gone. Both in a good way and in a bad way. So, but mostly good because the thing that sucked was that for me, like, after thanks, the aftermath of Thanksgiving honestly sucked because, long story short, my grandma on my mom's side passed away. And I was depressed throughout the whole month. And I've been feeling hella lonely for the for this past month. And on the positive note on things, like the for about the Chroma Quest incident of twenty twenty three, it is safe to say that I can return from break after a stressful time i'm not 100 percent sure if my main discord account is recovered yet but hopefully it is like i have been trying my best to reach out to discord up about the hacked stuff and like see if like there's some stuff that is going on if you know what i mean and to those who may have gone through the same situation as me i hope your accounts are recovered because I do not wish what you've been through on anybody else. And as for the Discord update, like, it's, it's, it was honestly a pain in the ass on what happened with both my individual server and the buddies Discord because the because the old buddy server got deleted out of existence and that pissed me the hell off and I had to make a new one which was a pain in the ass on its own and the old one and my individual one was pretty much fucked up like there were some chats that were deleted and there were some people that were that got the ban hammer for safety reasons and I have thought long and hard on this decision and I hope you all can understand and this so that the same mistake is so that the same thing doesn't happen twice I will no longer be running my own individual discord but on the positive note I will be around in the buddy server like there will be occasions to where I will hang out in VC and you in like if you want to just like hang out then I'd be down to do it and all I ask is that if you know my real name please only use my first na name because the first name is because I don't mind if people know my first name as long as they don't take advantage of it and of course my full name you, name that is something that I am not going to reveal anytime soon and I would rather keep it a mystery, if you know what I mean. So, yeah. And, and of course, like, you guys may know that I have changed the JasonJ51 handle to Mr. Jason MKNJ. So, in full, because I wanted to do this for shits and giggles, I changed it to Mr. Jason motherfucking J. So, it's pretty much like a inside... So it's pretty much like an inside joke meme, if you know what I mean. And speaking of the fact that the buddy, the old buddy server is got deleted, a new one is in a work in progress. And of course, something that I am happy about is that there is going to be, well, the new, the old buddies merch is going to be around for those who may want to get their hands on it, but. On it just for a little bit longer because of the fact that in what <sighs> fuck how do I word this the old buddies sir the old buddies merch is going to be around for a little bit longer and then we're gonna say goodbye to it temporarily but I'll say this much they will return in the new buddies drip market 
And something that I'm happy about with the group is that it recently got a rebranding and I am proud of the final execution of it. And of course, like, from a few minutes ago, I mentioned that the old server got deleted, but a new one is in a work in progress, so please give me time to work on that. And, of course, there is two things that is something that I am happy to announce. Like, there's... I'm going... So, and I thought of this idea pretty well, and, and Jack's brought up good point saying that it would be a good idea to like have both males and females in this idea and I figured why not do like half and half on both genders and of course the and of course we eat and of course me B Jax Rose Onyx and Ro and Beans have thought out a podcast team for the buddies called All Things Nerdy. Yep, I said it. I said it. I'm going to be a part of a podcast team for a YouTube group. And man, oh man, am I ready for some nerdy conversations we can have. And a smart move that I did was that as I was preparing the All Things Nerdy socials, I made a SoundCloud for the buddies that way it it has a way to be streamed outside of youtube if you want to have a listen on some conversations that we have have and there's also going to be a dungeons and dragons group called order of the amethyst oak that is going to have at least and there's four players for now and there's a fifth one that I, I'm probably going to have a fifth one. I'm not 100% sure yet on who it's going to be. So that's going to take some time to figure out. And as for the rest of the members of the buddies, like, like a new face that we have is Monster K Midnight. And, and they... And fun fact, like, he's a friend of mine that I met with through Wither Dash. Like, Withered introduced me to him, and he introduced me to him. So, oh, yeah, that's the best way I can describe it. Sorry if I'm having a Bringo Burr moment here. And, of course, for the Fantasy's Virtual Darkness universe, there is, is something that I am happy to say, which is... The Dio Ronin Legend Saga is finished. So if you want to take a read for yourself, it, oh, it is in my Wattpad. I, and I'm not gonna lie, the final execution, in is enjoyable. Like there, and if there's like any criticism that you have, have like, instructive criticism, then I'll be willing to listen because I feel like that, there. Well, I feel like most of it's going to be towards before dawn, but of course, or after dawn was a pretty good ending in my opinion, and I am happy that I was able to bring one final dark story to the Die Run and Legend Saga, and of course, there's on in the recent buddies. In one of the recent buddies videos, there was four titles that was confirmed that is going to be worked on, on for 2024, and and of course I did confirm one title in the squad of heroes, which is Gunblade Six. Yup, Gunblade. Yeah, and let me tell you, it has been two years, which is about to be three. Since I have worked on, on a, on the squad of heroes. And for the Fantasy's Virtual Darkness universe, the titles that we are going to have, there's two that I wanted to leave out. Well, there is four that is confirmed. The rest of the two will remain a mystery for now. So, oh, what titles are we going to have for the Fantasy's Virtual Darkness universe that has been confirmed, you may ask? 
there is going to be Carcanos in the Origins of the Dark Realm. Guardians of the Mirror Gate. Investigators of Revenge. And Undying. And surprisingly enough... And the thing that I will say this much of... There's going to three, be three horror titles in the Fantasy's Virtual Darkness universe. But, and here's the thing. For Paranormal Slayer, I am not 100% sure when I will start that story yet. Like, I have been thinking about... I have been thinking of, like, having the story take place in Japan and fantasy times for, like, about four years now. So, this means at the time of recording of this video, it's... It's three years, about to be four. And something that I've been thinking about for Paranormal Slayers, like, do, like, a balance of action and horror. So, this means that we have the three horror titles figured out by, just by category. Paranormal Slayers, Japanese horror. Investigators of Revenge is Paranormal Activity and Slasher. And Undying is a zombie is a zombie apocalypse and fun fact undying was originally going to be called the dead of midnight and of course like we do have like a, a small glimpse of what we could have for the lore of steven the t the yellow talgan and the title that i'm thinking of doing is last of the talgans so, yeah, and of course, my own problems is one that I'm going to tease because that title is, has a character who's a time traveler in After Dawn. That is your hint on who the protagonist is going to be. And what I have in mind for my own problems is that it's a persona insta inspired story and the story explains what happens to him before the events before he travels back in time to the events of after dawn so yeah anyway so that is all that i wanted to take the time about like i did tell you guys i did tell you guys that i was going to save some juicy parts for the end and get some basic stuff out of the way first so yeah thank you for taking time to listen to what i have to say and thank you for watching this video thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to your channel if you want to see some more content and if you want to see some irl content subscribe to jason j channel if you want to see some IRL. and if you want to see some gaming i will say irl subscribe to the crazy fox 51 channel and hopefully 2024 will treat us better than what 2020 well most of what 2023 did peace out